Alright guys, so I guess my game fucked up on me a little bit. Uh, yeah. And, uh, yeah, I had to save uh, those two people in the bar near him. So. But I got us back to the same point we were at. And now I'm gonna get the other tip from him. by the wheel. You gotta get this bike fixed in order to escape the city. So we're gonna drop that, I guess. Right Make on. another one of those easily. So we can take this back. Fuck him, leave the door open. Hope he gets eaten alive, that fucking greedy fucker. Who the fuck makes you pay five thousand dollars for a wheel? It's ridiculous. Should have gave it to me for free since I saved his asshole. Well, I didn't save his asshole, but I saved his ass. I would have grabbed the part from the shed that I got the key for, but you can only carry one part at a time. So, there we go. Got the wheel. I guess we can make another bat. Bring it on. We only have nine shells left for this shot. We'll use those on the way to the shed. Let's go shut this crying bitch up. So if I grab her gems for her, which is back at the roadblock that we were at, she'll give me all of her money. So fuck it. <laughs> Money's money. The only thing is, is they're pretty hard to find. I'm trying to remember where, I think they're on the ground somewhere, by the bus. I think. I'm not sure. I think that was a queen bee back there that I just passed up. Oh well. Turn out and shut your ass. Fuck away from me. Fuck, I got that guy from way back there. Are you serious? It's a shitty zombie. So the shed is right there. Okay. Fuck you. I know you want to suck my dick. Okay, so we got the forks. Thinking maybe I should just grab the gems. Maybe it'll let me carry both. I'm not even sure if it will or not. That's a newspaper and a football. Get the fuck away from me. Jesus Christ. Is that them? No, it's purse. Right, where the fuck are they? I know they're around here somewhere. Fuck, can't get on top of the van. What book is that? Hit the attack button. 
it's not a book, it's a snack. That explains it. Yeah, fucking bitches. There's the chicken shit. Alright, so if I drop the sword, can I carry both? Sweet. Alright, you little fucking dick. Alright, hold up. I need that snack. Oh, wait, beer. Sweet. You can rally. Fucking little bitches, man. Alright. We're gonna go Louisville slugger on these fuck faces. Fuck away from me. Wait, I can use this as a weapon. Fuck back, bitch. Jump in a void, jump in a void, jump in a void, jump in a void. Jesus Christ. So you have to find the wheel, the forks, the engine, the handlebars, and gas. I'll give you a hint as to where the gas is at. And in my very first playthrough when it first came out, that's the last thing that I found and it took me forever to find it. So yeah, I felt like a fucking idiot when it was right by the gas station. How come I can't just toss through the gems over the fence? <laughs> You're such a fucking crybaby bitch. Let's drop those real quick. Give her this. So fucking give it to me. Thank you. I got 23.8 now. 23,008. Whatever. Just real quick. So if I'm not mistaken, the engine is behind the theater. Yeah, the engine's behind the theater. The handlebars are behind the... I think it's a hardware store. But a guy has them, and he won't give them to you unless you bring them a, a sword. And then the gas is right here by the gas station. So I'm just going to grab the gas real quick. And then we'll go pick up our next survivor.
load times in this game are horrible. Alright, so we got three of them now. Oh, and also, while we do have that Zombrex, uh, that we found in the ambulance thing by the quarantine zone, um, one of the survivors needs it, and she won't come with you unless you give it to her. So if you want to get 100%, you have to give it to her. But there is another Zombrex inside of the pawn shop that, that dick guy owns that's $25,000 for one shot <laughs> it's like real world medicine so there's Bob I don't think anybody kills more zombies in this game than he does every time I pass by this guy he's just lighting them all up Okay, so he doesn't have anything for us yet. So we can go and get the, uh, the engine by the theater. It's a handgun right there. I don't know if I dropped that or not. Never noticed that before. Alright, long fall. Didn't lose no health. Because I'm badass. Also, a little tip that you'll learn from playing Dead Rising 2, the slot machine with the dollars in front of it, you can win from but only a certain amount of times. So if you're ever really in need of money, you know, just keep coming back to that. What is that knife? I unlocked the door and got ate by a zombie. There's the engine. Yeah. We'll grab that and head back. And I'll probably make it back just in time to end this video. By the way, there's a maintenance room over there. You can make shit. Unless, if you don't want to go all the way back to the safe house. By the way, I don't know if I mentioned it, but that theater was another one of the doors you have to open to get the achievement. So we're going to have all but one of the... There's the queen. All but one of the bike parts, but we have to wait for the survivor mission to get the last one. And that's the handlebars. Little fuckers. And then he somehow fixes up the bike with duct tape. Fucking duct tape can do anything, apparently. Saving survivors will give you lots of pee pee. <laughs> pee pee. Drinking liquids will give you lots of pee pee. Alright, so that's four of the five bike parts. I'm going to run over here and save it, and then go on to the next video.